This is the story of one week in my life. It was the week I fell in love. The week I would make my Broadway debut. What the hell is it now? And the week I would meet Orson Welles. John, this kid's gonna play Lucius. Will you work for nothing? Orson! Quiet, I'm negotiating. Orson's very competitive, very self-centered. This stage is where history is being written. Very brilliant. Okay, listen, people. Nail your words to the back wall, and that goes for the rest of you. Consonants, consonants, consonants. And don't forget the vowels. Don't criticize him, ever. No, sir, there are more with him. Not more with him, more with him. This is Shakespearean verse we're speaking. I know my lines. And I say you need more time. <laughs> So tell me who you are. What are you offering? Wealth, travel, fame. I can take you to movies that have all that. You're cute. The whole show is in shambles. He is an arrogant... I am Orson Welles! And every single one of you stands here as an adjunct to my vision. You don't like the way I work here? There's the door. There is water breaching the deck. Sabotage! This is the essential Orson Welles moment. We might have a show that closes Thursday night. We might have a show that people will remember for 50 years. Orson wants to stay with me tonight. You want me to fight for you? Because I will. You've only known me for a week. Well, sometimes you remember a week for the rest of your life. Images of magnificence. That's what you see in every great actor's eyes. That's all that matters in this world. I'm proud of every member of this company. You gotta be one of those magic nights tonight. Can you feel it? It's showtime.